guys, welcome back to my channel. I want to really quickly show you how to upload an Adobe Illustrator library directly to your Adobe Illustrator program so that you can access it within any file that you're in without having to open the original library. This is a great way to streamline your process and to just make everything faster and easier. If you're not doing this already, let me show you how. So the first step to add a library into your Adobe Illustrator program is to go into whatever asset you're trying to add. So I'm going to be using the uh, assets that I have available on my website as an example. So first thing we're gonna do is we're going to unzip this folder. And inside you'll see the brushes and symbol library, for example, in this one. Um, and obviously you could open up the actual uh, key that's included to open it up in Adobe Illustrator. But to get the actual library inside of your program, so when you go into brushes and you go down here and you go to user defined brushes, we want them to pop, pop up here and populate in this area. So that's what we're gonna do today. So let's go back and uh, we're gonna choose our brushes library. And then I already have um, the window open, but what you're gonna do is you're gonna go into your Mac um, and then go into users, your user, library, application support, Adobe, and then the most recent um, version of Adobe Illustrator, regardless if you're using an older version, it'll still populate. Um, and when you download a new version, if you're using cloud, it will auto populate into your new version. Then you'll go into NUS and then into brushes. And then this is where we're going to drag that library. So let's drag that here. And once that loads, you can go back into your document and go under user defined and you'll see that it's populated here. So I can just go into that and it'll pop up all of the brushes that are included in this library. And then of course you can do the same thing with the symbols. We're just gonna go under symbols and go to our symbol library and we're just going to pull it over. And then we can go in here and just double check that that worked and go into symbols and go into user defined and you'll see it here at the bottom and that's it all right guys that's how to upload a library directly to your adobe illustrator program and the assets that i'm showing in this tutorial are available on my site i have teamed up with michael clark from ready design to be able to bring you guys a huge bundle of over 200 adobe illustrator assets that are perfect for fashion design and drawing technical flats and fashion illustrations and you can check that out at pointsandmeasure.com shop or you can find the direct link in the description below